Grand Prairie, Texas. Find out what's going on right after this. Welcome back to Pear Rider TV, Grand Prairie, Texas. We got a drop, a loaded trailer, hook up to an empty. Go about two miles down the road here in Grand Prairie, Texas. I don't know if it's a live load or a drop and hook yet, but whatever it is, we got to get it and take it to Little Rock. So there's only one thing left to do. Let's get to it. our loaded trailer or getting ready to drop our loaded trailer and we got to try to find an empty I don't even know if they have any empties here they, they should have because this is a drop and hook facility for us so they should have some empties yeah so let me finish up with this trailer and go on the hunt for an empty when we find an empty I've seen a bunch of other trailers, but they're still in the dock getting unloaded, I guess. Well, this is the only empty I could find. And it's an older trailer. Got the old handle for the... That was easy. For the tandem adjustment. Because we do got to drop them with the uh, tandems all the way back. So when you pick them up empty, they're still slid to the back. Got the automatic tire inflation system, and they're all aired up on this side. See, it's empty. Yo! Yo! Yeah, it's empty. Fairly clean, too. Surprised. Some of these places we drop trailers, pick them up empty, and they're a mess. Oh, yeah, tires are good. We'll have an easy tandem slide. All we gotta do now is hook up to it. So you know what? Let's hook up to it. Well, an hour and a half later, I'm still sitting here where I dropped my loaded trailer. I was getting ready to send all my information over there to Little Rock on the Qualcomm and it got a message that, that my load over in Grand Prairie over there, which is 4.4 miles away, canceled. I'm going to sit here about an hour and a half and they finally sent me another load. So we're going up to Grapevine, Texas. About 18 miles, I think, to the load. I think, I believe that's the drop and hook up there. At least it used to be. And we're going to take that to Little Rock. So no big deal. Just going to uh, have a late day. Not a late day. I guess I'll get loaded and go over to the Garland Yard or something. Or maybe try to get over 
sulfur springs or something. We'll go up here and get this load, see how the traffic is, how long it takes to get up there, and how much time we have. But thinking about garland, I don't know. We'll see. I got all day tomorrow to get a little rock. That old trailer over there picked up this old trailer over here and we're getting ready to get out of here did a pre-trip on the trailer everything checks out all we gotta do is uh, send our stuff on the Qualcomm and we'll go fight traffic around Dallas Dallas Fort Worth well we right out of Fort Worth area but say the Dallas Metro mess, as somebody once referred to Metroplex 2. The Metro mess, yeah. <laughs> I think that's going to be it. We had a pretty easy day. Two dropping hooks, one load got canceled. But I think that was a live load over there. So that's it. I'm trying to make it somewhere tonight, not sure yet where, but I'll go ahead and end this video here. So be sure to subscribe if you're not. Hit that bell icon. That will be notified every time I upload a video. So everybody, have a good day. Stay safe. Pale Rider is a trucker. Pale Rider is a trucker. Pale Rider is a trucker. And he likes to do vlogs. Yeah.